Hey, my name is Austin Sweet. I'm the lead audio engineer at FX Sound. I'd like to talk about equalization, or EQ for short. It lets us increase or decrease different frequencies inside of a sound. If you want more bass, you'd use your EQ to turn up low frequencies. And if your audio is harsh, you need to reduce the high treble range, or if you want to add more of that throaty mid-range character, this is the tool that you need. We measure different ranges of sound by their hertz value, or how many vibrations per second produce that frequency. All that you need to know is that lower hertz means lower frequency and pitch, higher hertz means higher frequency. You can click and drag or use your mouse wheel to adjust each EQ band's target frequency up or down. Once you're at the frequency you want, again, you can click and drag or use your mouse wheel to increase or decrease that range's level. Many people ask us what is the right way to adjust your EQ? And the answer is that there's actually no right or wrong way to equalize your sound. It comes down purely to what you enjoy. To find your balance, choose something you know by heart to listen to, like a favorite album or a movie that you've seen a lot. Then just play around, saving the different settings you find that make your audio come alive. That way you can come back later with fresh ears and repeat the process, getting closer to your perfect tone. If you want more guidance while doing this, you can look for EQ cheat sheets online. These aren't going to be hard rules, but more guidelines that can help you correlate different frequency ranges to different tonal and timbral qualities.